it out if you uh, let me join your crew. Can't join the crew, Richardson. Don't do anything. Oh, don't I? Let him join. That's valuable. It's hard to do it sitting. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's about as good as you can do it standing up, too. <laughs> hey, welcome back to You, Me, and the Movies. Tonight, we got a special request. Special request. Granddaddy Raining Madness. Coming in hot. With? Hot Rod. Hot Rod. Yeah, here's what Raining Madness has to say about his pick this Yay! month. <laughs> Hello, Mr. and Mrs. Movies. This month's pick, Mr. Movies has already seen. I have, but it's been... Since this movie came out, since I've seen it, I don't remember any of it. But that is fine with me because seeing how Mrs. Movies will react is enough for me. Ah, uh-huh, nice. I find this comedy mood to be fairly underrated. The group that headed the production was a comedy music band that was frequently featured on SNL. Don't worry, this band I find to be legit funny, unlike SNL. <laughs> Called The Lonely Island. We are familiar with Lonely Island Island Boys. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Lonely Island Boys? That's, Isn't that what they're called? No, they're just The Lonely Island. You're thinking... Is Island that, Boys! Is that Island Boys. Andy totally Sandberg's group? People. Is it Andy Sandberg's yes, group? Yes, that's Andy Sandberg's group. Okay. Of the three members, one is director and two are in the movie, including Andy Sandberg, along with his SNL castmate Bill Hader. This mm-hmm. was the first movie I had seen with Ian McShane in it, and I can't watch a John Wick film without referring to the hotel manager as Frank, his character's name in this movie. I don't know what else to say about this film, so we'll just mention that my favorite Lonely Island song is Jack Sparrow. Michael Bolton kills it in that song, which is about him being asked to sing a song with the Lonely Island about going to a club to hook up with women. But he just got done watching all the Pirates of the Caribbean movies, and he'd rather sing about that. Don't let me hold you up any longer. Let's get started. Hopefully Mrs. Movies will like it, and that Mr. Movies enjoys it another time around. All right. Well, I'm sure I will. It's a comedy. Yeah. I like almost all comedies. Unfortunately, you can't relate to his favorite Lonely Island song because you've never seen the Pirates of the Caribbean movies. This is true. So we'll have to watch those sometime. At some so point, I'm enjoy sure that Michael we'll... Bolton song with the Long Island. I do like Michael Bolton, though. Office space. All right, well, should we jump in and watch Hot Rod? Yeah. yeah. Well, let's do it. Let's do it. But first, well, like, comment, subscribe. Come hang out with us. We're Hot Rod. It's a comedy. You're going to love it. Yeah, if you want to be like Rain Madness, get your own special request. Check out our Patreon link down below. We can also get early access, full comedy access, pulls up, spiggle watch next. Link's up there. Check it out. We also have social media, so if you like social media, follow us. And if you don't like social media, that's whatever. It's cool. We don't care. Let's watch Hot Rod. Here we go. I have seen a few episodes of Brooklyn Nine-Nine, and I enjoy Andy Sandberg in those. I haven't really seen much else that he has done except for, like, Dick, <laughs> Dick in a Box. Yeah. A couple of the that's SNL song. things. Wants to be like Evil Knievel, obviously. Who didn't? Did we reinforce the takeoff ramp? No, we didn't have time. <laughs> You'll be fine. Oh, it's got, uh, what's his butt? Danny McBride. Yeah, thank you. Is he going to make it over the... No, not a chance. He's pedaling. Oh, God. He made it over. Are you okay? Oh, yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> He's got a concussion. He's all right. <laughs> it's one of those electrical pedal bikes, right? You got to yeah, pedal and start before it. those were cool. Right? I mean, now they're, like, standard. Everybody's got one of those bikes. Mm -hmm. Except for me. I don't have one of those bikes. It seems like a really confused bike, though. Like, wants to be a dirt bike, but it's not. (laughs) He's really cool. He's nailing it. Oh, toasted marshmallow. That's my favorite. Raspberry? Psych. Berry cherry. 100 straight. <laughs> 100 straight. I'm gonna go drop some dumpage. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Gross. <laughs> <laughs> it's 
exactly the phrase you use when you tell me you gotta go poop. <laughs> Dumb bitch. <laughs> I just found a bag of fireworks in the men's restroom. Would you guys like to light them off? All right, boys, prepare to be dazzled. Dazzling. It's a better outcome than most fireworks found in the men's restroom. It's true. Rod, maybe you shouldn't fight Frank this week. You know, you could rest up for the jump tomorrow. Relax, Kev. I'm gonna win this time. I did like 40 crunches yesterday. <laughs> Kevin, he's your real dad, so he automatically loves you. But he's my stepdad. I have to earn it. <sighs> Ancestors protect me. <laughs> May they protect you. What a weird fucking family. <laughs> <laughs> Stepbrothers. You can trust that's a dead man. Oh, Frank! Oh. <laughs> Never sneak up on a man who's been in a chemical fire. Sorry. On your oh. feet. He's the Deadwood guy too, right? Yeah. Very, very lethal. Oh, Rhodesian, of course. <laughs> right, right in the shins. Punch. <laughs> <laughs> that was a kick. All great men have mustaches. Yeah, but real men actually grow them, huh? You no, know I have a hormone disorder. <laughs> oh. Oh, take out the trash. <laughs> He's a good stepdad. He's helping him build character. Oh, yeah. You're jumping the pool? You should come. Maybe I will. Thanks. Cool. No, no pressure. The girl next door will be there. He's not going to make that jump anyways. You look pretty. What did you say? Uh, I said you look shitty. Good night, Denise. <laughs> <laughs> Seems like something you'd say. You look shitty. Good night. <laughs> hey, Pop. I sure wish you were alive. You tell me how much you respect me, and we do stunts and grow mustaches how old is together. He? Do we know? He's probably like 20 or 18. I miss you, Daddy. <laughs> hey, Rob. Get out! Oh, the fake cry. <laughs> I might happily get out if you, uh,. Let me join your crew. Can't join the crew, Richardson. Don't do anything. Oh, don't I? <laughs> Let him join. That's valuable. It's hard to do it sitting. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's about as good as you can do it standing up, too. <laughs> <laughs> You're not wrong. <laughs> This does not feel good. <laughs> I've done this before. He's done it before. That's not enough of a running start. And his bike is r running like a quarter of a horse power. He's got this. Please God, don't let me embarrass myself in front of Denise. It's definitely gonna happen. Nailed it! Well, at least he didn't hurt himself. That's so true. Yeah, yeah like, always a good a place to yeah, do it. It's a yeah. win. Also, barely made it halfway across <laughs> the pool. <laughs> it's Frank. He's very sick. He needs a transplant. And our insurance won't cover it. Do that. Hold on, oh. Frank! Don't die! <laughs> Beating me wouldn't mean anything now. I'm all through. All I want is to earn your respect, Frank. How can I do that if you won't fight me? Well, maybe you should have thought of that before you sucked at being a man all your life. Oh, my God. <laughs> I am going to get you better, and then I'm going to beat you to death. It's <laughs> 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 great motivation. <laughs> Let's to kick his stepdad's ass so he's going to save his life. <laughs> Got a little footloose moment here, huh? <laughs> oh, 
I do love Footloose. Where are you looking log? <laughs> A pummel log. Oh no. Black sheep moment. It's alright, he's a stunt man. <laughs> oh jeez. Really launching him. Oh, <laughs> Oh shit. Oh, the rocks had to hurt. Oof. He's alright. Soaking. <laughs> and that is how it's done. <laughs> He's really good at high fives. High five master. We're gonna raise the money to save Frank's life. Well, that's awesome, Rod, but uh, how exactly do you plan on uh, doing that? We're gonna jump 15 buses. That's nearly as many as Evil Knievel. It's actually one more than Evil Knievel jumped, Rico. I know. I checked. By my estimations, we'll need to raise around $5,000. That includes bus rentals, ramp construction, team hats and wristbands, and a $9 per diem for each crew member. Now you're talking. It's <laughs> a lot of per diem. Let's celebrate. Our daughters love popping bubbles like that. Yeah, they do. Hitting an engine. You can't join until you go through initiation. Uh, all right, what's the initiation? It's like the craziest thing you could even imagine. Ah, Rod! Rod! Welcome aboard. <laughs> I he just made that up. Slurpy on your feet. <laughs> In their faces. And then when I'm done, all their little wizard. You probably wine. had Heelys, didn't you? No. That was after my. My time. Did you have Heelys? No. I had soap shoes. What? Soap shoes. Don't know what that means. About ourselves. I'll start. My name is Rod, and I like to party. All right, Dave, you're up. Uh, my name is Dave, and uh, I like to party. Uh, no, Dave, I just said that I party, so maybe do something different. I'm Rico, and I like to party. Yeah. Uh, Rico, what did I just say to Dave? Who? Dave. I like to party. I'm Rod. No. <laughs> no. Okay, nobody parties but me. Yes. And we party. No. Yeah, just Rod. Yes. And me. No. <laughs> party before. No, Kevin, I know for a fact you don't party, okay? You do not party. You're right. Dave's the party guy. <laughs> Sweet. Oh <my laughs> do you party? No. No. You don't party? Not a partier. He who is resistant to change is destined to perish. So why don't you try to open up that mind of yours? You know, it's like, look at Kevin. I mean, he's real mature, man. Yeah, don't you ever tell me how to live my life again. <laughs> Strengthening. You guys are going to hold me underwater for 40 seconds. That's 20 less than a minute. If there's any problem at all, I will ring this bell. want some great punch. Maggie, don't even ask. Just bring it. <laughs> <laughs> of course we want great punch. 8, 39, 40. Okay, let him up. I don't know. It's like you trying to hold your breath for 40 seconds. <laughs> yeah, it's not going to happen. I got 10. I got maybe 10 seconds in me.
right, I'm just gonna go wash off this puke from my face. Cool. <laughs> G-Force. Let's run it. Oh, God. My safe word will be whiskey. Sorry, Rod, what was that? Whiskey. Whiskey. What? You're saying it weird. <laughs> saying what weird? All of it. <laughs> I just don't get why you're saying it that way. Why I'm saying what what way? <laughs> I, will. I will forget it. Denise! No Asian way. No. <laughs> At least he's got a helmet. I was worried about this for a second. What is this? What's the safe word going to do? They can't stop him. <laughs> oh, oh <shit>. yeah. <laughs> yeah. My thoughts exactly. Hey, what are you getting your dick hole smashed? Oh, 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 I'm freaking pumped. I've been drinking green tea all goddamn day. <laughs> God, I go to church every goddamn Sunday. You gonna bring the demons out of me? <laughs> This is totally my hat. <laughs> so you get out of paying for the damages. Embarrass the guy by kicking his ass. How do you like being in the crew so far? It's been interesting. I told you. Oh, jeez. And I was just wondering if maybe... Hey, Rod. What's that song called about the grandma getting run over by a reindeer? Grandma got run over by a reindeer? No. <laughs> Come by and surprise my little girl. Uh oh. So, what are you supposed to do? A stunt man? How about you, Precious? I'm a team manager. <laughs> <laughs> He's like twice her age. Yeah. Well, probably not really, but... I was going to ask you who you think would win in a fight between a grilled cheese sandwich and a taco. Is that really what you're going to ask? Yes. <laughs> um, grilled cheese. Grilled cheese. Yeah. If it's prison rules, I'd take a taco. Wow. That's pretty racist, but correct. <laughs> She likes older guys. An older guy's nice. Like, he'll give her all the things, but he's going to be loyal, right? This guy's a loyal guy. Why'd you marry an older guy? You're more like him than that older guy. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you have more of the characteristics of this gentleman than oh. of the other one. <laughs> okay. I'm pretty good at stunts. Yeah. You're going to overlay your, your parkour. Parkour, yeah. In the video. Yeah. <laughs> you will overlay it a little bit. Black sheet on it. Launching him. Oh. <laughs> oh shit. Okay. No, I 
I don't see anything. Fuck. I'll vomit if I see blood. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm afraid cooler heads have prevailed. You're the devil! <laughs> All right. That's enough. Frank, back to bed. Rod, outside. Fine. Have fun being married to Satan! <laughs> <laughs> It's Coast Coast AM song. Is it? Yeah. Oh. Not great reflexes. Jeez. Tell me about Jonathan. What's that dude all about? Well, we've been going out for about a year. Mm -hmm. I wonder where she's from. It looks like a smallpox vaccine scar on her arm. Nothing. Hey, Dave's back. <laughs> you guys, the bathroom here is nuts. <laughs> Are you asking me out? <laughs> oh, Kathy. <laughs> wow, Rod. I can't believe she said yes. Yeah. <laughs> it's the same way I asked you out. <laughs> Training is going really great. My reflexes are sharp. I'm crazy agile. <laughs> Who are you talking to? <laughs> <laughs> Do you think he has a different jumpsuit for every day or is he washing every day? I bet he it, it's the same jumpsuit every day and I bet he does not wash it. <laughs> oh, speak of Diablo. Bombs away. Oh, there's a flavor. <laughs> <laughs> Why, you don't like flaming Dr. Peppers? Wait, no way, Sully. Babe, I gotta say what up to Sullivan. Okay. Don't you two go falling in love while I'm gone. <laughs> <laughs> like, that'll happen. Sullivan, you chode. I owe you a shot to the nuts. He seems like a peach. Have I ever showed you a picture of my dead dad? No. Oh, you've got to see it. He's super dead. Not in the picture, just currently. He used to work for Evil Knievel, testing his bikes before big jumps. He would do the jumps first to make sure they were safe and then let Evil come in and get all the glory. His front tire exploded like a cannonball and his handlebars went straight through his head. Oh. <laughs> His teeth were ground down to a powder. <laughs> the front of his face exploded out the back of his skull. <laughs> he died instantly. <laughs> the next day. Instantly the next day. <laughs> oh, Quite the visual. It's a sad story. Starting right now, we're gonna fill this jug with five grand. Let's work. <laughs> oh god <laughs> best birthday party ever They grew up so fast. Get the fuck off my porch. Sounds good. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Do it again. Jeez. Stuntman. What? You're a terrible stuntman. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I can hear you. 
It was just really mean. <laughs> Is there a Tai Chi move that would make a grown man craft his pants and not know why? That move does exist, but you're not ready for it yet. As you wish, Sensei. Does she know it? <laughs> <laughs> that didn't work. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna get going, so. <laughs> so now I'm gonna go, because there's nothing left for me to learn. Thank you, though, for trying. That was very nice of you to try. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but it's not really finished, so. Oh, uh, that's, uh, that's something else that I'm working on uh, for a month. Not for me. <laughs> right. Mom likes that stuff, so. <laughs> I'm Rod Kimball, stuntman extraordinaire. Life is short. Stunted. <laughs> uh, that's it. It's awesome. Are you kidding me? I loved it. You're the next Douglas Bubble Trousers. Wow, Rod, thanks. Who's Douglas Bubble Trousers? They're going to sell a bunch of tickets to that 30-second video. He's helpful. <laughs> Soon I'll jump 15 buses, and then I'm going to kick your ass. I'm going to assume you're laughing at some funny dream you're having. You're a pussy. <laughs> and I'm genuinely sorry about the window! <laughs> hey, how are you? No way. Sold out auditorium. Is this a different video? It's just improved. You think positive. Yeah, they're, they're laughing people. with you, not at you. Yeah. yeah. Like I always do when I laugh at you. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, dang. Is that his car, too? I failed, Mom. I lost all the money and people laughed at my stunts. They're comical. He's a comical stuntman. Not a serious stuntman. I haven't been completely honest with you about your father. You see, he wasn't a stuntman. So how did he die? He choked on some pie. What? Come on, seriously? He wanted to win that contest so badly. <laughs> hey, at least it was a contest. It's pretty stunty. Rod! You did She's used to having people laugh at her. Yeah, Carrie. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Just a cart full of liquor? I used to be legit. In fact, I was too legit. I was too legit to quit. <laughs> I'm unlegit. And for that reason, I must quit. <laughs> That's buddy. Hard to say. Yeah. Hey, man, what's going on, man? I just, you know, wanted to call, see how you're doing. Maybe you'd want to hang out, you know, possibly take me to the hospital. But, uh, you know, it's probably just precautionary, you know, if you just want to swing by, man, I totally appreciate it. Yeah. What's wrong with him? I don't know. It's 
probably just precautionary. He packed a suitcase to go to the hospital. Hey, Rod, thanks for the ah! Oh, God. Hey, buddy, how's it going? <laughs> and, uh, you know my buddy Derek? Well, he was like, I've got this acid, but I can't do it. And I was all like, I'll do it. So I did it. <laughs> so I decided to get on my bench grinder, and a uh, piece of metal flew up and hit me right in the eye. It's pretty awesome. <laughs> I've got a mountain for a face. I'm guessing that's the drugs, Dave. <laughs> Bus. <laughs> I don't know the way I look at it. You still got this other dad at home, sick in bed, and, and if he's sick and you've got the talent to make him better, well, to deny that would just be dumb. Trip and Dave, pretty insightful. Yeah. How big is that metal in his head? You think? Yeah. Not too big. Teacher. There are things that I don't want to learn. <laughs> I used to do that to my stuffed animals. Yeah. It was really awkward when you walked in that one time. And I'm He's sorry. the play school barn. And silo in his closet. Silent. I have the barn, but not the silo. So cool. Cool beans. Cool beans. Cool beans. Cool beans. Cool cool beans. Beans. Cool beans. Cool cool beans. Beans. Sweet. Cool beans. So before the screening, I took the liberty of posting some of the stunt footage online. Great. As of this morning, it's been downloaded over a hundred thousand times. It's bouncing around the web like a beach ball at a Nickelback concert. <laughs> KNER called us. The AM radio station? And they want to sponsor the bus jump with all the proceeds going to Frank's surgery. And what'd you tell them? I think you'll be needing this. A new mustache. That looks like way more than five thousand dollars worth of stunt material. Well, they're the radio sponsoring, so it's oh okay. So they're going all out. Yeah. If it was their five thousand dollars, they'd just have a ramp made by what's his butt, Danny McBride. <laughs> Mr. Fasnack is the owner of the radio station that's funding the jump. And I'm the number one DJ. When people hear me describing it over the radio, they are going to remember that AM radio is a viable and modern source for news and entertainment. <laughs> I've got a tattoo here that fully illustrates my point. And he's urinating on an FM radio. And then this other stream of urine is going on to that television <laughs> to imagine that he had sex the night before and now a little bit of residue is blocking his urethra allowing Ew. the urine to flow in two separate directions <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> that was gross what it happens does it though sometimes Ew. soon am radio will reign king once more <laughs> <laughs> Uh, maniacal laugh. Let's see if those are even plugged in. <laughs> Denise, it's Rod. I'm jumping 15 buses tomorrow at the fairground. Hope you can make it. Who is that? Wrong number. What a dick. We're gonna sell tickets and people are gonna hear about it at home on the AM radio and donate money. <laughs> You're gonna get yourself killed. Well, I'd rather die than live in a world where I can't kick your ass. <laughs> I can't wait to punch your face in. And I can't wait for you to try. <laughs> they have such a fun relationship. Man. Yeah. 
Think he can make the jump? No. Some random fisher yeah. oiling him up. Just helping him out. I believe in him. <laughs> if anybody can attempt to jump 15 buses, it's Rod. Oh, I think he can attempt it for sure. Jeez, riots, huh? <laughs> that was crazy. What the hell? Was that because of us? I don't know. I mean, it started off super positive. Then it just... <laughs> None of us did. Yeah, it was totally messed up. He's got a TV. Yeah. There was no time to do anything yeah. except just leave and just hope that you're not hurt. <sighs> Kimball is going to attempt to jump 15 buses today. We would bring you coverage of the jump, but apparently an AM radio station has the exclusive broadcasting rights. In other news, riots. So you're saying it could be on TV? Who signed this exclusivity? Probably Kevin. <laughs> Here you go. Thanks, All right, thanks, guys. And don't let your dads eat pie. <laughs> What was that? We just hit a raccoon. Jonathan, <gasps> don't you think we should stop? Oh, trust me, babe, that raccoon would not have stopped for us. <laughs> <laughs> I hit a raccoon once. I felt so bad. Maybe I'll get a box of dong bags so we can knock boots later. What do you think? Ew. Jonathan, Rod's doing the jump. Oh my god, who cares? You're embarrassing yourself. It's only embarrassing if you care about people think. <laughs> That's a good one. My motto. Babe, babe, wait! Babe, 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 wait, babe, no! <laughs> babe, 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 no, babe, wait! <laughs> oh my god. Just save us all TV, too. Look at this. Jacket. One thing, Rod. I know how you like explosions and showmanship and stuff. So I rigged the whole jump with fireworks. And I got you this rock. Oh, cool. Rico. Yeah, you can pretty much just toss it after the fireworks go off. It's cool. Thanks. <laughs> you do a couple more test runs with that thing to get used to it. You ready? Yeah. I hope that in some small way, all of their sons manage to jump them. I think they're doing their own stunts upstairs. <laughs> what the hell is going on? I think they're riding their, their ponies. <laughs> I think this did a whole lap around the house. <laughs> I can't tell if that's both of them or just one of them. <laughs> yeah, it's just a little one. That horse is bottoming out. <laughs> Do you want me to yell at her on the camera? I mean, don't yell at her, but maybe ask her to stop riding her horse around the house. Can't make that shit up. <laughs> hey, you guys. Uh, we're trying to record. 
So if you could not do a bunch of stunts upstairs right now, that'd be great. I don't think they heard. She said, sorry, Dad. Is she sitting in that little stroller? Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> You're going to have to go up and talk to him. <laughs> I think it's time for bed anyway. <laughs> I'm gonna get you better, you old sack of shit! And then I'm gonna uncork the ass beating of a lifetime on you! And you will respect me! Peace. Hope he didn't violate any FCC regulations there. Mm. Clearly he has a few issues with his stepfather, eh? Who doesn't? I know I do. <laughs> <laughs> we always have issues with our stepdads. You wouldn't know. No. <laughs> Do you like stunts? What about terminally ill stepfathers? If you answered yes to one or both of those <laughs> questions, you couldn't have picked a better day to My stepdad used to always race me. Yeah. He was, he was always faster. Yeah, he had to lose Then every I turned time. 13. And he beat him? Every single time since then. <laughs> but who would win in a fist fight? What? But who would win in a fist fight? Only if I let him. <laughs> you are pretty shifty. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, well, she likes an open mouth kiss, huh? Those are my favorite kind of kisses. Oh, wait, why, why is Rod kissing his sister, man? Oh, uh, Denise isn't his sister. <laughs> She's not? Shatters my entire universe. Well, I'm not saying that <laughs> this was hot, but if the boner police are here, I demand a lawyer. <laughs> Gross. What a, what a perv. <laughs> Knock it up. Boner what? police aren't here. It's fine. Uh, okay. Can he do it? Is he going to do it? I bet he crashes af afterwards. Souls of the animal kingdom. Eagle. Fox. Bottlenose dolphin. Octopus. House cat. Okay. Let's jump this jump. What's the octopus going to do? He cleared all the buses, though. He didn't stick the landing, but he made it across. It's got to count for something. I, for one, hope none of them had a fight with Rod this morning because he is more than likely dead. He's <laughs> probably having some sort of profound out-of-body experience. Oh, good. <laughs> Ooh. Seriously, you probably hurt pretty bad. I'd say definitely, Kevin. <laughs> and the phones are ringing off the hook. Hopefully he makes enough to cover his medical bills, too. Now you just gotta find a heart donor. Ghost, 
<laughs> what? You've never seen A Christmas Carol? You know I don't like that movie. Ooh, he's got his own mustache coming in. Sexy. That accident sparked some hormones. <laughs> Get ready to meet your maker. <laughs> What's up now, Frank? I'm doing this because I love you. Who's gonna win? Think Rod's ready for his time, right? I might actually. Throwing oh, star. What the hell? Is that a throwing star? Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> well, he landed the super punch that time. <laughs> oh, jeez. It's gonna make him poop his pants. Think so? Come on, let's it. Ow! Me. <laughs> 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 Made him poop himself. Possibly. Possibly. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. All right, Hot Rod. It was a good one. Yeah. It's still an SNL movie, right? Yeah. A little bit. Well, Lonely Island movie. Lonely Island, excuse me. Like, when they were on SNL, they were the best part of SNL. And I didn't, kind of, I didn't they're, they're love their own thing. That was kind of like the beginning of the end of SNL for me is that yeah that I era. That they were the last funny part of SNL. Mm. When they all left, it was kind of it's all been downhill since then. Yeah. Yeah. So what do you think? Funny? Yeah, it's a good one. Yeah. What was your favorite part? The swimming pool, I think. The swimming pool? Yeah. When he only makes it halfway across. Yeah. Just a street. I thought he was gonna make it. No, you didn't. No, I didn't. No. <laughs> huh? I like Babe Wait. Will Arnett. You liked what? Will Arnett. Babe, wait! Babe, wait! Wait! Babe! Babe! Uh, see that? Wait! That part. Babe! That part felt very SNL to me. It just went on, like, a smidge too long, if, you know? It makes me think of Arrested Development more. Uh, well, yeah, I mean, that was very much an Arrested yeah. Development character. He's basically playing. What's his name? Job. Job. Yeah, Job. So, yeah. I love the rest of development and Will Arnett. It's a good one. Uh, he does the voice for... Uh... Oh, God, what's his name? Good story. He does a voice in the Twisted Metal TV show right now. Of the killer clown in the Twisted Metal oh. show. That's I actually heard it's pretty good. No, I haven't heard anything about it. Yeah, so... Oh. Danny McBride's always good. Yeah, he's... His comedy style is so unique. Yeah. And hilarious. I mean, he is the same character, every character he plays, but mm. it's funny every single time. He, I mean, he is, is he's similar, but he also brings a new flavor to that character, depending on what they His are. delivery is always the yeah. same, you know? Yeah. I, I feel like we got to watch his first movie, for The Foot Fist Way, where he plays a Taekwondo oh, okay. instructor. It was like his breakout like, role. Fame, like, yeah, <laughs> it's a good one. So, yeah. But I've always liked this one. It was pretty... I mean, it's just a silly, fun comedy. Yeah, yeah. Right? Very good. Yeah. Not, doesn't take itself seriously. At all. Reminds me of, like, a Joe Dirt. Yeah. Yeah. It's about the same era, too, so... Yeah. I should make a sequel. Hot Rod 2? Yeah. Hot Rods? Hot Rods. <laughs> now he's racing cars. <laughs> yeah. Just like that. Racing cars instead of motorcycles. Yeah. Who's your favorite character from the movie? Other than Rod. Um, Dave. Dave? Yeah. Yeah. He was the get shit done kind of guy. Yeah. He was kind of like the motivation. Mm -hmm. He built him a motorcycle. He was the only one that had a job. And he had... Yeah. He did a lot of things. Including acid. Right. So, don't, don't do drugs. All right, stay don't off drugs. Metal stuck in your eye. It's not good. You have to go to the hospital. But yeah. What about you? I agree. Okay. Or, uh, you know, what's her name? She's pretty cute. 
Isla, Isla Fisher. Fisher. Isla Fisher. Isla Fisher. Isla Fisher. Yeah. Oh, whatever. It's a name. It's a person. It says someone let me know where she's from. What country she's yeah, what from. What country is she from? I'm pretty sure she's married to Bo Rat. Is it must? Is it like South Africa or something? I don't know. She's got a, a small a smallpox vaccine scar, which is unique for somebody her age. Yeah. Yeah. If she's American, but I don't think she's American. Well, what should people comment on after Hot Rod? Favorite scene. Yeah. What's your favorite part of Hot Rod? Other than the amazing stinger we just watched. That was it. Right. Yeah. What's your favorite what's your favorite part of Hot Rod? Yeah. And favorite character. Favorite character from Hot Rod. Anything and else? Thank you, Raining Madness, for selecting a comedy, which I absolutely love. Yeah. If you want to be like Raining Madness. Check out our Patreon link down below. You might get you know snag one of those special requests lots. You can also get early access for the comedy access to polls, homes, big world next. Links down there, check it out. Until next time, have a good one. Bye.